Okay, so what we've got here is a espresso machine, a DeLonghi Sculptura. Um, this is the second machine, not this make before. It was a, I'm not going to tell you, but it was a certain make and model. Um, I weren't too impressed with it. I'll tell you why in a little while. But let's unbox this and have a look, see what it's all about. Okay, so what we got? Obviously got the handle and where you put the coffee in and this one is the uh, you can see that on there that's for uh, double shot and you got another one which is single shot This is for, you can see that just there, that's for the uh, the pods. So I'll probably be using the double shot, but going twice because um, I have a big cup. So this is all well and good. It's nice. And obviously you've got your steamer for your milk. And there. On off coffee or water and steamer. So that's all good. And you've got a little rack up here for your cups. Let me see that. Probably not. Little rack for your cups. So they don't form up like a little warmer, so that's quite cool. Drip tray, obviously, which you can take off and uh, wash it out. And if you've got a bigger cup, you can put it in the bottom here, which my one is. That's my cup. Get to it. And what I like about this one, compared to the other one, you can actually see the water level on either side, where the other one, you have to look right around the back to see the actual water level. This is a water tank. 1.4 litres is your maximum line. So we give that a wash out. It stinks of plastic. That was my grief with the other one. Um, even though I washed it out, as per the instructions, you can still taste uh, a little bit of and smell plastic, um, which I weren't too happy about. Plus the like the motor, like the, uh, the the little boiler. And the pump sounded like a tire inflator, which was really, really loud. And I've seen these, I've seen this one before, and it's not as loud as the other one. So in the end, I've sent it back to get my money back. So we get all this set up, and. Uh, We'll give it a whirl in the morning and see what it's like. So, we'll see you then. 2,000 years later. Okay, so it's been about two weeks later. Um, thought I'd test it for two weeks and uh, see what I thought, because the other one, as I was absolute crap. Um, I really like this machine and it's 
done really well. So obviously you get the uh, the one for for two cups. But the port filter, I went out and bought a a bottomless port filter. Um, plus it takes a bit more coffee uh, for the for the big mug, which I've got here, obviously. mug and uh, so what I do I'm gonna run it through switch it on go take the bottom off bit of tissue in the bottom oh yeah and I also bought a uh, a nice metal press a nice rubber mat and I bought the frothing pitcher milk pitcher as well so what we're going to do is get a coffee. Press play. Food. Once this has gone off, obviously there's not enough uh, water in there for me. So um, what you have to do is wait for this green light to come back on. Like that. And just go again. And what I do, because obviously it's a big cup, um, I go about three times and uh, fill this up because I don't have milk, uh, so I can't show you a cappuccino. But I will do, I will do one when I do one for the wife. Oh, I'm also on the lookout for a nice stainless steel one of these. Pretty much. So just go again. Lavazza, Lavazza, um, very good. Uh, really, this is decaffeinated. Uh, not a sponsor, but if they want to, they can. So I put the tissue there just to stop any drips, and it's easy enough to clean out. You can just take that off, obviously. Put that in the sink. A nice little clean out and I'm ready to go again and uh, so that's all good. The machine itself is uh, really easy to clean. I say I, I'll put this in the bottom just to catch the uh, drips because obviously I haven't got a drip tray on it. And then you just put that in there, switch that off. And I say I've got this this one, and then I bought this one. The matching hand is nice is nice and is a uh, wood. That's all good. So, do recommend this machine. 
Um, I say they're not a sponsor, the Longi. But again, if they want to, thank you. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Cheers, guys. See you later.